Hello guys welcome to you. In this video we are going to see how to download and install Epson L3100 printer driver in a Windows 10 PC or laptop. It is a very easy and simple process. So let's go to our video. First we check our PC or laptop is 32 bit or 64 bit. That is very easy. Go to this PC, right click on this PC. Here we find properties, click on the properties. In properties, we find system type. If you find at this point 32 bit, then that machine is 32 bit. If you find 64 bit, then that machine is 64 bit operating system machine. This machine is 64 bit operating system machine. Close it. Now go to the our web browser. Go to the any web browser that you like. I am going to the Google Chrome. Here type Epson L3100 printer driver. Hit enter key on our keyboard. Go to the first link. First link is from the Epson. Open the first link. And our Epson website is open. Scroll down and this website automatically detect your operating system automatically. But in any case, if it's not detect your operating system, then go to the here operating system. Click on please choose an OS and go to the operating system and the bit. My operating system is Windows 10 64 bit. So I go to the 64 bit. If 32 bit, then go to the 32 bit. I am going to the 64 bit operating system Windows. Go to the go, click on the go and your page is refreshed. Scroll down once again and here we find our drivers. Our first drivers, first IMP drivers for us, printer drivers and second is the scanner driver. First we download the scanner driver, then printer driver. Go to your scanner, click on download and it's redirect to another page. Click on accept and our download is started in a few seconds and it's complete in, completed in a few minutes. So be a patient and wait for a few minutes. Less than a, one, one minute, our download is completed. Click on here, show in a folder. Click on show in a folder. Drag this to the desktop. Close it. Our scanner driver is appear on our desktop. Go to the, our web browser once again. Go to the back from here. Here we find our printer's driver. Here we find printer driver. Click on download. And our, our page is redirect to another page. Click on accept. And our download is started. It's a few minutes, so be a patient and wait for a few minutes. Our download is completed now. Go to the here, downloads, and here we find show in a folder. Go to the show in a folder, minimize it. Drag this setup file to desktop, close it. Here is the our printer driver, and here is the our scanner driver. We first install our printer driver. This setup file is actually a zip file, and we are going to extract this zip file. Right click on it, and click on the extract files. Click on extract files. Click on OK. It's extract our folder. Double click on this folder, newly created folder. Here we find one folder. Double click on it. Double click on it. And here is the, our drivers. And we are going to install it manually. That is very easy. Go to the start. Type printers and scanners. Click on the printers and scanners. Here we find add a printer or scanner. Here we find it is searching for the, our printer and scanner. In one second, new option is pop up. New option is the printer that I want isn't listed. Click on that. Minimize it. Here we find many options. Go to the last option. Add a local printer or network printer with manual settings. Select the last option. Go to the next. Here we find port. Port is the most IMP part in this installation. Go to the here port and find USB port. If you find USB 001, 002, 003, 004, select USB port. And if you not find USB port, then go to the comfort. In this case, I find USB port. So I go to the USB port. Attach your USB to your printer and make sure your printer is on. Then this USB port is show to us. Go to the next and go to the have a disk. Go to the browse. Go to the desktop. Here we find our driver or the folder. Double click on our folder. Here we find our folder. Double click on it. Double click on our folder. Here we find two set of files. Click on any file that you want. I select the first file. Click on open. Click on OK. Here we find Epson L3110 series printer. Select the our printer. This is an actual series of L3110. And click on next. You can give any name that you like. I give the 3100 and remove this series. You can give any name that you like. Click on the next. It's installing our printer and it takes some time, less than one minute. So wait for less than one minute. Our printer is installed now. If you want to share this printer in network, then click on share this printer on network. I don't want, so I select the first option. Go to the next. 
Here we find printer test page. If you want to print a test page and then click on the printer test page or click on the finish. After that, go to the start and go to the power button and restart your machine. Restart machine is very IMP. After machine is restart, go to your scanner driver. Here is the our scanner driver. Right click on the our scanner driver. Here we find run as an administrator. Click on run as an administrator. Click on the yes. Click on next. Accept terms and condition. Click on next. It's installing our scanner. It's take less than one minute. So wait for less than one minute. Our scanner is also installed. Click on the finish. Now check our printer is properly installed on our Windows 10 PC or laptop. That is very easy. Go to the start. Type printers and scanners. Click on the printers and scanners. In printers and scanner, we find Ipsan L3.00 printer is installed in Windows 10 PC or laptop. So guys, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share, comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you guys.